For the whole world, the war in Ukraine is still far and far. For so many people, Ukraine is still an unknown East European country, and Russia is something weird near Siberia. Well, let's take a closer look. This is Ukraine. After the Soviet Union, it went its own way with mistakes and wins, with hard-working people building a new country, free and successful. And this is Russia. Accumulated natural resources, military potential, many times bigger than Ukraine. Ukraine. Russia failed to become democratic and soon chose the Soviet Union way when a former KGB agent came to the presidency. Ukraine has been developing infrastructure, IT facilities, fighting for freedom of speech. Ukrainians almost got rid of all the pro-Kremlin politicians on its land. And even after the annexation of the Donbass and Crimea, Ukrainians managed to improve the economy and continue to grow in all areas. Russia continued to build the George or well reality, starting with its mass media, manipulating, repressing its own people and quietly spreading the Russian threat all over the world. 2016, Russian interference in the US elections is well known, as well as the attempt to do it in 2020. Same year, Russian interference in Brexit, the investigation is still on. Separatist moods are the favorite Kremlin trick all over the world. Same year, Russian bikers drive to Berlin with Soviet symbols and motto We Can Repeat, making jokes of German role in World War II. In two years, bloody attacks using chemical weapons on the British citizens by the Russian spies in the UK itself. Nothing happened then, no equal response. 2017, Russian interference in Spain politics, referendum in Catalonia and social media fakes and appeals to go on the streets, the same signature. 2018, yellow vests and France begins investigation of the Russian track in the protests. For years, Russia has been provoking a migrant crisis in the Middle East, destroying Syria, killing half of the million of people there, and making survivors run to Europe. Staying under the migrant crisis in Europe, Russia and its ally Belarus tried to repeat the trick in 2021. And now they are trying to repeat it again, ignoring any international moral human laws destroying and killing. There are also international relationships that the world tries not to pay attention to. Russia and Taliban close diplomatic weapon ties with the experts in terror. Though it's okay for some countries and companies. Portuguese media report that the country is ready to receive the Russian gas next week. Facebook, even when blocked in Russia, continues to ignore pro-Putin groups, messages and users, destroying its own reputation. Russia has been penetrating Western countries for years. On the other hand, pro-Putin bots, paid influencers, continue to reassure that it's a new normality, but it is not. And if bombarded and devastated Ukraine one day falls, the numerous, armed, cowardly and inadequate enemy will knock at your door, Europe. They already planned this. Kremlin politics scientists already say they will not forgive betrayal of Germany and the military operation will not be measured by Ukraine. But you have already heard something like that 80 years ago.